team forecast. Michael, I heard the rain this morning. Did it affect you at all today? Yeah, we did have some, some light rain in parts of uh, central Alabama and still Jen moving across uh, the eastern, western part of Jefferson County. Some heavier downpours. So the farther west you are just west of I-65. Uh, that's where that rain is happening now and it's nothing severe and it is enough to get you wet though. So just a nice soaking rain, but this initial batch of showers will move on through here. Now we'll continue to have a few sprinkles uh, throughout the rest of the morning into the afternoon, but uh, right now from uh, Fultondale, Gardendale, uh, then back up toward a warrior east of Summerton between really warrior and Summerton. That's where we have the heavier rain falling at the moment. Now, this is not the major concern. However, as we progress throughout the day, we will have some clouds this morning, some fog in place as well. And then as we get into the late afternoon hours, notice how the temperatures will become more and more unstable in the lower 70s in advance of this cold front uh, that will bring a lower end risk for a few strong to severe thunderstorms uh, later this evening into tonight through early tomorrow morning. Now we're on a scale of one to five in terms of our severe weather threat. We're at a two northwest of interstate to 59. We'll say no, along and northwest of a line from uh, Tuscaloosa, the northwest part of Jefferson County, north of Gadsden, southeast of there on a scale of one to five, with five being the highest risk. We're at a one, but it's still fair game and it's certainly the farther north and northwest you go. Some damaging straight line wind and even a few tornadoes cannot be ruled out. We're not expecting a major severe weather outbreak, but it will be an inconvenience as we head through the first half of the weekend. So as we progress into late this afternoon to the evening, uh, the rain chances with thunderstorms increasing from the northwest to the southeast, a line of strong if not severe thunderstorms passing through central Alabama uh, by late tonight through early tomorrow morning. Then this will taper down to still some showers continuing at times by Sunday morning, but the severe weather threat ending around 6 o'clock to start your Sunday. Jen.